In this video, we'll take a look at the completion features of Illuminated Cloud. We can begin by creating a new Apex class. We could use any of the out-of-the-box or custom templates, but we just need a simple class. We'll call it Editor Features. Completion in Illuminated Cloud is offered for identifiers and keywords in a context-sensitive manner. For example, Illuminated Cloud knows that you can only extend classes and that you can only implement interfaces. Okay, let's go ahead and implement a method. We'll create a method that queries a set of accounts, returns them. This will show some of the completion capabilities of SQL as well as Apex. You may have noticed that Illuminated Cloud offered completions for identifier names based upon inferred data types. So we'll query a list of accounts the IDE knows that we're querying accounts and is only showing us fields from that object type. So we'll get the account number, the annual revenue, the username of the owner. That's a relationship in the query. And it automatically knows that we're querying accounts, of course. Let's constrain the query results where the last activity date is greater than, say, last month. And now we can just return the list of accounts. You may notice that Illuminated Cloud is tying together the declaration and the references automatically. Now let's show some of the other features of completion. Apex has some very unique syntax qualities. For example, compile time constants for S object types in their fields. Illuminated Cloud offers completion for these. Let's go ahead and get the name of one of the fields of the opportunity object type. Illuminated Cloud also offers completions for Apex compile time constants for page references. These are obviously useful, for example, in visual force controllers. Additionally, Illuminated Cloud saves you significant typing when you use the collection classes of Apex. You don't have to type in the type parameters twice any longer when you construct the, the instance. Instead, Illuminated Cloud will populate the type parameters for you. Illuminated Cloud is constantly evaluating every expression for its data type. This allows us to chain expressions together in complex ways. For example, indexing into a map to get the list value type and then indexing into the list value type to get a field. Apex features a unique constructor syntax when you create S object instances. The parameters of the constructor are themselves the fields of the constructed object type with assignments of, of values. And Illuminated Cloud is aware of this and automatically offers completions for all field names, as well as the ability to complete any Apex expression for the right-hand side. Completion is also aware of enums. For example, let's log at the error level. Now let's take a look at completion in Visual Force. In Illuminated Cloud, Visual Force editing takes place within Ideas HTML editor. We'll create a new Visual Force page. Completions are offered for Visual Force components and attributes, both system and custom. Because this is hosted within Ideas HTML editor, you also get completions for all HTML5 elements and attributes. If an attribute has a constrained set of values, you'll also be offered the, those values for completion. Let's take a look at completion for full components. Illuminated Cloud knows about all system Visual Force components and their attributes. We'll go ahead and insert a page, page messages component.
and now we can create a custom component. We happen to have a type ahead field component here and you can see that it's also offering completions for the various field uh, attribute names as well as whether those are required or not based upon the component definition. And then we can set the value of the we can set the values based upon a visual force expression. And again, HTML completion is fully supported. We'll create a JavaScript block. And a div with a table within it. That offers a pretty good overview of the completion capabilities of Illuminated Cloud for Apex and Visual Force. Thank you for your time.